as a workman or a business person, if people cannot trust you with money, my dear, you are destroying your chances of ascertaining financial growth. Oh yes, if you lost the trust value in your business or your work, my dear, you have lost the patronage inflow in that your business or that your work. Take note of this. The only thing that overcomes hard work is hard work with sincerity, my dear. If you must grow as a businessman or a workman, you must build a life of sincerity. Oh yes, you can never grow in business if you are not growing in trust. The consistency in good and quality work impute generates opportunity and the offspring we call luck. You can never expect more work or more business from people if you are not putting smiles on their faces through what you do. It is amazing how much you can accomplish when it doesn't matter who gets the credit. Your good work builds trust around you. Remember, trust is better than credit. Loving what you do is not enough, but building trust around what you do is crucial. You can't lose creativity. The more you use, the more you have. But you can lose trust once you start abusing it. Listen, sometimes you are the problem you are facing in your business or your work. Nothing destroys a businessman or a workman more than greed. Oh yes, if you can overcome the power of greed in your endeavor, you will go far. Greed is a bottomless pit that exhausts the person in an endless effort to satisfy the need without reaching satisfaction. Greed is a very fat demon with a small mouth. Whatever you feed it is never enough. All the money you are making out of greed depreciate your value as a businessman or a workman. The material they are selling for 10,000, you will say is 50K. I'm not saying it's wrong to make gain as a businessman or a workman, but don't put greed in your quest for that gain so that it will not destroy your business relevancy. All growth depends upon activity. Oh yeah, there is no development physically or intellectually without effort to build people's trust, my dear. You are destroying your life success if you are not building trust, my dear. Build trust around you. Build trust around your business. That is what will make you grow. Listen, we are what we do. Excellency is never an art, but a habit, my dear. Build a habit of honesty in what you do and you will see yourself growing rapidly. If you are working on something, you know how to do best, my dear. You don't even need to push people to patronize you. People will advertise and recommend you based on their encounters with you, my dear. So before you start disturbing God for business success, my dear, make sure you are building people's trust in your business, my dear. Make sure you are sincere in your business because God can only come in when he sees sincerity in what you are doing. Oh yes, some of you are not trustworthy. Make sure you are building trust in that your business, my dear. Make sure you are good in that your business, my dear. Make sure you are sincere. Make sure you are building people's trust, my dear. You are not sincere. You always lie. You are not trustworthy. How do you think you will grow in business? How do you think you will grow in your work, my dear? If you don't have sincerity in your endeavor, my dear, you are falling. Listen. The plate that holds your success lies on the golden tree of sincerity. If you want to grow in life, learn how to build trust around your endeavor, my dear. If people are not trusting you, my dear, you are falling. If people are not recommending you, my dear, you are falling financially, psychologically, and otherwise. The chicken change you are making in your business or in your work can never take you high. What will take you high is the, the trust impact you are making in your business. People will patronize you based on their trust in what you are doing. As you take your business or your work serious, my dear, also take people's trust more serious because they are your stepping stones to greatness. A word is enough for the wise.